Hey, this is Terratoots with a quick tutorial on importing multiple 3D objects into Terragen 4 using populations. In a previous video, we covered importing a single 3D object into a scene in Terragen 4 using the OBJ Reader tool. But what if you want to import many 3D objects? For example, trees to create a forest. In this case, you'll want to use populations, which efficiently manage the memory you needed to create a large number of object instances. Let's add a population of trees to this scene. To begin, click the Objects tab. Add Object, Population, and then TGO Reader. Then we'll select one of these trees, which I have in TGO format. You can also use the OBJ Reader if your object is in OBJ format. When the file first loads, you won't see anything in the preview. That's normal. However, notice the two new entries that have been added to the left plane. The bottom one here is our tree object and the one above it is the population of trees. Right now, our population is empty. In order to actually create our forest, push the Populate Now button. Let's change the object view mode from bounding box to textured to get a better look at the result. We can also use the ray traced preview with shaders and lighting turned on to get a better idea of how our population fits into the overall scene. It's important to know that anytime we change the settings of our population, we'll need to repopulate in order to see the changes take effect. For example, our forest is looking a little sparse, so let's go ahead and decrease the spacing of the trees. When we click Populate Now, we'll see the forest become more dense. In the next video, we'll talk about how to control the placement and properties of our population.